I am Three Fools Monster, and I am bringing you a sniper gameplay on Call of Duty Ghosts. What's up, guys? It's my first gameplay in quite a while, and this is going to be the first of many. I know I say that, I know I say that, but I'm, I'm seriously, this is, a, this is a whole new breed of monster that you ain't ever seen before. So let's just jump straight into it. Now you can see I'm using a the thermal scope, yeah. and I'm using the USR in this game, in this actual Great. gameplay that you're watching right now. And Henry. people are going to yeah. criticize. Some people are going to say, "Why do you need the thermal scope?" Blah 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 yeah. blah. This cheater site. Blah 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 blah. Well, you know what? Oh, the thermal scope. Anybody could use it. Up. It's not a cheater site. It's it's actually overused. I and to be want. honest with you, this game on the PS3. Not, I mean, it's not that great of, of quality visual, visually, and it's harder for me yep, to right see people there. across the map without the thermal scope. And you know what? A lot of people have been running incognito now, anyway, so it makes it even all that much more of a challenge. So let's get into a little bit about the thread, the thread title, the video title. Okay, the video is titled "Quick Scoping Fact or Fiction." How to do it and is it real? Okay, so let's just get straight into that. What does it mean to quick scope? Oh, I'm just failing. What does it mean to quick scope? It means to quickly scope your gun, just like it says. Obviously, everybody scopes their gun up at the same speed, but it's it's all about the speed at which you shoot after you scope your gun up. If you're new to sniping and you don't know and you hear people say, "Oh, you're a hard scoper" or Oh, you you just hard scopes. You're not a good quick scoper. You're not a good legit sniper. Blah, 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 blah. They're just mad because they died. But anyways, the reality is quick scoping means how quickly you fire your gun after you pop your scope, your sights up. Yeah, it's exactly yeah. what it means. And what a lot of people don't want you to know, what a lot of snipers don't want you to know, is the truth about quick scoping. Now, I, I have done in the past, I've done a video that went on to do pretty well about the truth about quick scoping, and I'm just gonna touch on that for a brief second. And that is, quick scopers don't. They don't. the The real way to quick scope is, is to scope in, and shoot when your crosshairs are over the enemy. You don't shoot before then. You don't. You don't pop your sights up and shoot before your sights are even all the way up. You don't do that. I mean, you can, but the consistency behind it is is terrible. The 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 hit rate. It, let's say you pop your your scope up, or you're going to pop your scope up, and you shoot before your scope comes fully scoped in. The consistency for getting hits like that is terrible, terrible, and that goes back to what Call of Duty you're playing. You'll notice. And take again, I'm using the thermal scope so it makes it easier to identify in this game. You'll notice every time I shoot somebody, almost every time, just about every time, you will see the white around their bodies. And I would say 95, 90% of my kills sniping in this game are quick scopes. And the big debate is how long you're holding your scope up, if you're holding your breath, blah, 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 blah. That's not quick scoping, that's hard scoping again. That's just butthurt snipers that are getting beat. That's all it is to it. So let's go fact or fiction and how to and the truth behind it. So I've told you guys right there was a perfect example of a good quick scope. You're gonna say that wasn't a quick scope because I seen his I seen his face. That right there was a good quick scope. You're gonna say that wasn't a quick scope because you had your scope up for so long. But in actuality the way that the kill cam shows the game, the way that the game is recorded via kill cam and how the enemy sees you is different than how you actually play. And that is the biggest, trickiest part about the whole thing is the enemy sees a, a half a second behind of what you're actually doing. I know that's hard to understand and a hard concept to follow, but it's the absolute truth. Oh, look at that spawn. I just, let me just run out in front of an enemy. But anyways, that's the absolute truth. Look, quick scope. Yep. So that kill right there, you just see me get a second ago. The enemy, since he's seeing a half a second behind of what I'm actually doing, when he died, he probably in the kill cam didn't get to see me scope all the way in. But I still took the shot because he still died. So in the kill cam, the game is gonna show him. Oh, the, 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 in the kill cam, the game is gonna show me pulling my sights up, but not all the way up. 
so you won't see the white outline of his body in my scope when you're watching the kill cam from his end. It just won't exist. Oh and back in the old uh, Call of Duty games like I'm Black Ops yelling, and man. when they had uh, Modern yeah, Warfare 3, when they had theater mode, yeah, so. you know, when they did theater, it lets you see the game from the <laughs> enemy's point of view. And they let you see it from their time frame as well. Again, I've touched on this in old, really old videos about how what the enemy sees, the kill, what the kill cam shows the enemy, and the theater recording versus what you see. And it all goes back to the enemy sees a half a second behind of what you actually are doing. And that goes for everything. And I don't know if that's because of the lag compensation built in or whatnot. But that goes for everything. So even if you take an extra couple seconds to get the kill, like right there was a pretty decent quick scope, and you're gonna say it wasn't a quick scope. But if I had recorded this same game from the enemy's point of view and watched that kill from the enemy's kill cam, you would say, oh yeah, that guy just quick scoped you. Because from his point of view, my shot came off quicker. Remember, a half a second difference. So my shot looked like it came off quicker than what it actually did. So when you're when they when they say oh you're quick scoping blah blah blah, it's there's there's a slight time difference and it's it's kind of hard and complicated to explain. So let's get into the fact or fiction about quick scoping and everything. Are there multiple types of quick scopes? Which it wouldn't make any sense because how do you have multiple types of shots where you're literally just scoping in for half a second? Which remember, you're scoped all the way in when you're doing this. This isn't something where your sights pop up, don't don't pop up all the way. You're scoped all the way in to where in a thermal sight you can see the white outline. So, is there multiple types of quick scopes? Yes, there are. There are different types of quick scoping, and that's just based on acquiring the enemy in your target. How you acquire them in your target. When you pop your sights up, do you move your scope and adjust as you're scoping in? There's probably like a half, I don't know the exact amount of time, it's like 0 0.4, 0 0.3, number, 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 the time it takes to scope your sights in. There's that much time to adjust your sight as you're scoping in. And there's different different names for different things, and I'm not going to get into all that because I know I'm going to have people in the comments going, it's called a drag shot, it's called a, it's called a look away, the flick shot, blah, 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 blah. And so the answer to the, is there multiple types of quick scopes? Uh, yes, there are. Play, right there. Another answer is, how long does it take, how long do I have to wait to shoot? Or how early do I have to shoot to, to be considered, a, to have the shot be considered a quick scope? And the answer is, once you acquire your target in the middle of your crosshairs, you shoot. Don't, don't, take, don't take any extra seconds. They'll say, oh, if I could hear you breathe. If you pipe your sight open and you start start holding your breath, if I could hear you breathing, then you've taken too long. And you can go by that mantra. That's an okay mantra to go by. But the fact is, just wait until you acquire your target. Pull your scope up. Once the vision becomes clear inside your scope, shoot. And then that, that would be considered, you know, I don't know why they don't call it a quick shot. They call it a quick scope. It doesn't make any sense to me. Anyways, hope you guys enjoyed the video. I'll be coming out with new videos, more intriguing videos, more mind-bending videos. I will catch you guys next time. Peace.